Oh no, we don't want to hear from this creeper, don't we? Anyhow, this is Brett, and he has had people who he used to love, but he's, he'll never be with them again. This is Bailey, his ex-wife. This is his dad. Oh yeah, this is his mum. Oh yeah. This is his cousin, Michael. A nice creeper. Okay, uh, this is Marty, who's no longer around. Um, this is Trevor, uh, his other brother. Marty's also his brother. And this is his sister, Vespa. From many years ago, before Bert would have been born, this takes place in, like, a weird stone building with no windows. Derek is inside at work, where all of a sudden, his wife uh, sneaked in. Yeah. His wife, named Jackie who apparently was lurking around in the storage room for some weird reasons going on whatsoever. But anyhow, sometime later, after one creeper was born, the next creeper was born. Oh. <laughs> anyhow, it takes us uh, into the little stone f weird thing um, in the rock dumps. And what hospital are they going into? Well, uh, to where a creeper would be born, not in that building we just passed. It's somewhere near through there, where all of a sudden the creeper named Brett was born. Anyhow, and then sometime a little bit later, or a few years later, as we can point out, uh, it would uh, take place uh, in a little waterfall. Brett is the second child. Oh, Squid, what, what are you doing? Get out of the screen. Anyhow, yeah, uh, Marty's older than Brett, so yeah, Brett might be the second. Anyhow, Brett uh, doesn't really tolerate that. He didn't tolerate the silverfish for them, plus he had a bit of a problem and he got a bit of an infection off of it a few times. Anyhow, there's a wheat farm here where Brett used to love a bit of the wheat to chew on when he was little and when he used to have parties, uh, when his cousin was like, when he, when he had little Michael come around then, uh, yeah, he used to get Michael hurt and uh, outside of the castle, this is what Brett would pass by occasionally. Anyhow, and then Brett would even uh, have uh, some friends named one Patrick the Yellow Creeper, the other was Brandon the Normal Creeper, and this uh, skeleton, Skeleg, the skeleton, uh, a huge spider there, which was somehow lurking around Brett's school. And what we passed there was the Chokey, and this is um, the teacher, Hero O'Brien, where Brett would get hit by a few times, but anyhow, maybe not hit, but we then come across to uh, some like lovely sugar loving creeper a creeper couple named herbert and hannah who apparently like had children or it's a bit similar to derek and jackie except they're a bit more nicer and sweet and then a little bit later brett met bailey who apparently had a bit of a rocky start but then they warmed up to each other quite quickly and brett would even play video games in his spare time and would even show bailey sometimes and this is where it's near around um, near bailey's area where I was a mysterious area with a bit of cake outside, and then what we saw there was uh, inside the shot of Bailey's house. So anyhow, but then, sometime later, we had a bit of a problem. Brett accidentally put Derek in some sort of mess where it's near an oven, and... Yeah, oh dear, but as we move forward, there's a butcher thing going near uh, Derek, but... <sighs> he died. Brett lost his father, but a few years later, we then come across where it, something's going near Jackie and then A.K. Brett's mother, Jackie, died too. But yeah, all of it was going a bit wrong. But yeah, anyhow, Brett and Bailey were warming up to each other even more. They were just having a bit of a party and even had a bit of a pool party right there. And then we come across to here where we've got um, like Notch and Jeb and Steve, okay, and then we would have Alex here too, okay, <laughs> I don't know how this is going, but whoa, I don't know how I'm looking at all of this, <laughs> and it takes place in the sewer, with, yeah, um, Brett used to have a bit of battles out on this baby here, yeah, oh man, that's how Brett would have get, gotten a bit of a um, affected nose and Brett used to have problems around poisonous potatoes and then these would be the times where he would go traveling around as he would have been like a full adult full creeper adult where it would not only be at the hotel we passed there but through the forest which looked a bit like center parks oh man who would have thought but anyhow we then continue with his travels and even through the tracks, not only just the road back there, 
but who oh dear we then come across to a bit of Brett, uh, bit of a thing. What Brett allergic? What what is Brett? What Brett is allergic to? And it's revealed to be cauliflower. Or, oh. and he even loved the baked roll tarts too. Well, Brett was going through the jungle one day where all of a sudden he came across to a cat, and he had a huge fear of cats. Then, uh, thanks to having a little accident with it when he was younger. Yeah, just like some of the creepers. Oh, and he was in the snow where apparently back there wasn't really the picture. This was the real picture. But then um, a bit of time later, some hours are all over the place. All of a sudden there was a bit of a war going on in between some silly soldiers. And then one shot uh, an arrow on fire, which crossed into Vespa, which got her killed. It was kind of a sad day and... Uh, Trevor and Marty were like sobbing and yeah and then Brett was uh, just sad but didn't really have too much care for some reason but anyhow as we could see back there um, Brett uh, travelled into some into a new place that looks more like a town, a valley and a, a place full of cottages what? oh okay we have come across words here where he's found his own home through a trap down through a trap door oh it's it's where uh, Brett uh, would have resided uh, from 2013, if that would have been it. At, at least for quite a long time until the day he was arrested. That's what, but we're not going to get to that bit yet. You may never know, but yeah, the thing is, uh, Brett would have been to a bit of books then. And he even, there's even pictures for you guys to see on what his couple of his jobs were like. Yeah, anyhow, and one there was like a bit of construction. He kind of loves, loves looking at some swimming pools in any hour. And what we come across to next is uh, the siblings of Bailey's. Those were like, I think they're like Brett's ex sisters in law, and you think about it. Anyhow, and you may wonder how are the brothers doing? Well, uh, I just want to let you know the stone thing there was. Um, for Martin, uh, never brick kids for Trevor, and that's that's where they would have lived at from that time being. I don't know if they lived there today. And oh man, is this not just house we just passed? Whoa! And but it would have even actually came across to some famous Minecraft YouTubers. One was Exploring TNT, the other was Golden Armor, the other was All Pros, and this one here is the mining movies or oh, i'd say films and much more and he would even uh, sneak uh, into the famous minecraft server as well one's mindplex the other's hypixel one is the hive that's no longer available and much more but then uh brett would go on a little bit more a little bit more in his time of traveling where he would have uh, came across through a little bit of like it got a bit awkward for him or something and that's where he would have uh, slowly discovered who would have transformed into dogs. But we're not going to get into that bit yet. He, he just found some wolf, wolves and tamed ocelots, which apparently got a bit weird for him to see. So, yeah, that we're going to look through. He was just um, having quite a decent life. Um, he was actually uh, quite alone and OK with um, Bailey. I don't know how what you'd call it uh, when they're in a relationship together that's going all quite well but then for a long time later uh brett would have worked in a sweetie shop for a few years and the picture you guys would have seen just then he he got fired from their sweetie shop due to the fact that he would just do naughty things which i can't even explain but anyhow as we go forwards <laughs> well we're now uh, looking into how Brett is, tra is going to travel into the real world since he might want to get a bit more advanced as he was getting a bit bored of the current home he was around in. So all of a sudden he's come across to a warp pipe and he's got himself into the real world. But is it the real world? We may never know. I don't know what he would have got into, but... <laughs> I'm surprised he even fit through a pipe. And would this be the real world? Ooh, we're going to have to explore it. I think it would be a realistic world, or it should be the weird dimension for him, as I'll point out. 
But anyhow, it's around the time where he's met a few guys like Fiona Gaines, I'm sure, at least Fiona and his family, or even classic friends, or or just maybe old friends, whatever you like to call it. He would have met them as soon as possible because um, they were the first of Brett to trust. Not only just his own cousin Michael, but he's even met um, the guy behind the white shadow named uh, Boss Dude, who's my best friend, Owen, then Bowser, and then myself. But I actually met Brett first uh, before a few others would that are not fair and for goodness sake um brett would have uh, even met leo um aka leo the anime man who would have been behind the black shadow um the picture bef after leo's shadow would have been my family but in weird stages but anyhow i've met brett after i had a little bit of a fallout with bowser jr not bowser jr sorry terraria blue wins the room you guys would have passed where it had Brett's face on it. That's the location I met Brett at. And soon afterwards, I'll tell Brett a few video games like what you would have passed there. Anyhow, Brett would have gone through a little bit of walks uh, just from time to time if he needs to calm down whenever he'll have a little bit of a problem around me. Okay? Anyhow, that's not only where we're going. Yeah. Brett would have kind of loved the walks from then. But as, as we would have advanced quite good, um, I got back with um, Terraria Blue, okay, who were uh, my former enemies, but I became friends with them again, anyhow. And then, uh, yeah, I would have, like, oh, well, I'm going to have to say, I mean, Brett would have um, come across to these Terraria guys for the first time, which apparently was kind of surprised meeting someone who's also n not in the same dimension as him. But as we're all gathering together slowly, we then uh, come across to what you guys would have seen was Sandy Balls. That was like one of our first holidays together and the bench you would have seen there, uh, Brett would have loved standing on there uh, just because he thought he'd like to be a bit of a guard. And the reason why he came to look after us is because um, he wanted to be um, a little bit he wanted to try and get the job of being a bit of an assistant, but that didn't really work out for him very nicely. Yeah, what I'm trying to tell you all is um, the little fairies like Guide Fairy and Evil Guide Fairy, they wouldn't pe pay Brett, literally, so... The few pictures you've seen, one where it was in my back garden, <laughs> Brett would have climbed in there for the first time, and Brett would have even travelled on top of the vehicles with Bailey to get to places like Centre Park Slomleet. That's where I would have been a few years ago. Look at that. This is what Brett and Bailey fitted in when they were in centre parks with me. And it was probably one of our last times. <laughs> probably one of the only times that that got a bit okay. But anyhow, Brett would have even loved exploring in Ikea's. But then as we slip into where he wouldn't have been evil yet, he met a very cheeky pup named Skyless Eye Voice. And... A month later, Brett would have even proposed to Bailey, which uh, got quite well for some reason, and he would even watch board games, uh, nom down on a bit of large cupcakes when he would get mad, um, walk into big supermarkets, and we would have even gone to Little Hampton together, or something like that, where we would have killed off the guys who betrayed us, and that was Terraria Blue. They're now ghosts nowadays, and we would have even had a party to celebrate a little bit of a building that was built back at school. But anyhow, Brett would have even uh, walked into Fort Park to see what it was, the lot of it was like. And then Brett would have even got married with Bailey. And then uh, we would have uh, had a bit of um, World Cup around the time, and then Chase, the eye voice, was met, the worried one, who was a bit nice of Brett at first, but all in the background. Devon's uh, beca didn't become much of a kidnapper as he would have been back in 2017 anymore. Um, Terraria were ghosts, as I could say for good. But as Brett and Bailey were married, uh, something was in inside Brett's mind. Whatever he was thinking might have not seemed a bit right. I mean, whatever Brett could be thinking about right there might not look too good. So, peace without Terraria piece of Devon being good and oh is are those Brett's thoughts 
Yeah, but Ailey wouldn't be much pleased about this. As you can look closely, guys. Brett is... Oh, oh, oh no. That That's looking a little bit terrifying. Oh, whatever he got. He got it on us. Oh, and now he had the infection. Whatever this is. Oh, yes. And because of what we we're going through, even the cheeky pup got it, but the others stay out the way. <gasps> Bailey found it so, from whatever you'd call it, um, she started crying. And that's when the grass was dry all around us back then. What a dry year in 2018. And this would have been one of our last holidays with Brett. Um, it was in Centre Park's Elfton Forest. If we go through all the forest like this, we can show you proof on what it was like for Brett and Bailey for the last time. And yeah, we were all having a bit of a good time. But anyhow, uh, and these are going to be the activity photos you guys have to be seeing. It's what Brett would have last seen before we would have just got away for gits but anyhow all might have uh, ended quite kind of well didn't it but oh whoever this guy is he's got the cages and he's kidnapped those terraria guys or friends of mine oh it was going a little bit wrong i mean brett was uh, somehow slowly enjoying a little bit of quiet for a weird reason but as it got a little bit normal again and Brett thought of something something that he didn't particularly liked oh dear I'm going to let a lot of you know he's getting a bit of thoughts that are a little bit oh pardon me there yeah and where Brett was kind of treating Bailey a bit too harshly they divorced because of uh, Brett trying to change the rules, even though we said, no, thank you. No, thank you, I tell you guys. Oh, man. And, and where Brett was um, being harsh towards Owen, yeah, we thought, or well, Boss Dude, aka Boss Dude, we thought we'd all like to throw Brett in jail for what he would try and do to us. But however, quite a while later, he would break out of jail for a weird reason by... I don't know how I'm going to tell you guys, but he gained powers out of nowhere after thinking of those thoughts all over again, which I don't know why. He even had a, like a little staff where it turned us a bit similar to Waluigi from SMG4 from three years ago. Oh, man. Yeah, and he gained a bit of powers over time. Powers of rule breaking. Ugh. And not only that, but he just hated the way uh we had difficulty speaking and all that and you'd even uh, turn everything a little bit blood 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 like or even dark like and look he's gotten a bit of the powers over the mumps how frustrating is it to look through all of this i will tell you guys uh after all these mumps we uh come across and meet the five from Sonic Boom, who apparently are just a little bit friendly as we come across. Look at this. How sweet. Yeah, and uh, we even meet um, uh, the Sky the Kind pup, Chase the Brave pup. We are the clones of the pups that I voice. But then over time, uh, we come across to Dark Fairy, who uh, Brett had a bit of problems with and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, became Dark Bowser. Don't know what would have happened, but Brett's Dark Bowser would hurt Boss Dude very badly. And with the ghosts you guys saw there, yeah, Brett caught, uh, messed them up. And and then, as even if Brett would have been in jail, what not, he even met more like the Koopalins, the princesses, and very later on, Eggman. All of that became a bit wrong. And nowadays, if you uh, guys looking into the dream right now, we pretend to be in the kind pup stream. That's where Brett is more major on the damages. Anyhow, we can uh, move on now. Thank you.